Okay, guys. Hey, guys. This is Jose right here. So I am traveling, and before I go, I want to leave my equipment nice and clean so they can rest very nice and they can be ready by the time when I get back home to make some more money. So that's the process that I do when I clean my equipment. I hope you uh, are doing great and please enjoy the video. Okay, Lankard friends, for this process, we're gonna be using my um, electrical pressure washer. This is from a very, very cheap um, house tool department. Um, to clean my stuff, I normally use super clean the liquid liquid one so today I'm gonna be using the foaming one this is gonna be my first time using this product this one not this one I've been using this since I saw this in another uh, another YouTube video for one of my friends and uh, I normally clean my stuff with that kind of product I'm sorry it's a little windy but it is what it is so we're gonna put this baby to test I know it's off right now because I haven't used it. Like I say, it is my first time. I'm not going to put some water, anything like that. Oh yeah, it looks beautiful. A little bit on the rinse. Um, why do I pressure wash my equipment for that reason like that, right there? For that reason right there, guys. That's the reason. You see that grease? Let's see if we, uh, super clean can do something about it. Take a look at the carburetor right there. It is really gross. This is the way how I clean it. Since I never used it before. There's always, always the first time. containers like a, a one gallon so I mix it up and I put it over here and I like it because it's easy to spray like I say foamy spray you get all over 
it is good but I prefer this Just wait for a little bit. Let the liquid do the job. guys that's how I clean my stuff basically whenever I ended up my weekly a little early and I had time to uh, clean my equipment I'm always do because it's better to do it after you done all the properties it is what it is guys so stay safe and enjoy life